revealing the spiritual uses and secrets of salt. Destroy your enemies, destroy causes and shams just with the use of salt. That is what I want to disclose in this video. So if you want to destroy shams, you want to destroy your enemies, you want to destroy causes, make sure that you watch this video from the beginning to the very end to know these powerful spiritual uses of salt. Divine revelation you need to know over salt so that you can make use of it in a perfect way to get yourself out of causes, out of destruction, shams, and to deliver yourself from the hands of the enemies. But before I proceed on this video, I want to tell you that you are most welcome to this channel. In case if today is your first time to see this channel, do well to join us by hitting the like button to support this channel. Subscribe and make sure that you turn on the bell each time I upload a new video, it will notify you of my new upload. Now, if you want to destroy your enemies, you can use salt. You want to destroy shams, love spell that you don't want, you can use salt. There are many things you can do with salt. Once you do anything with salt, the most important thing you need is faith. With faith, whatever you pray for, as far as it is a good thing, it will come to manifestation or it will come to pass. All you need is faith and trust God. You will see yourself moving from success to success, from prosperity to prosperities, and things will keep working good in your life. So it is all about the spiritual uses, secrets of sorts. That is what I want to teach you in this video. Number one is that with salt, you can dissolve, destroy impurities. Yes, salt helps to absorb impurities. What is impurities? Impurities are those things that affect human life or human destiny. It can be any form of negativity. It can be causes. It can be sham. It can be black magic buried on the ground. With salt, you can dissolve it, you can destroy it, you can cancel it and put an end to its effects in your life. So salt is very powerful. In the scripture, Elijah used salt to sanctify the land. I have made videos, a lot of videos concerning salt. So Elijah used salt to sanctify the land, to purify the land so that the children of God we live happily. Those ailments, those diseases, negativities come to an end. So you have the same power like an Elijah. But the difference between you and Elijah is faith and how close you are with God or how close you and your God is. So if you want to get a divine intervention, make sure that you back up your prayers with faith. Trust God. You will see that things will keep working for you. I am giving you assurance. This is very important. So anytime you pray, make sure that you back it up with faith. Just like Elijah, you will see things working for you. So in case you want to destroy impurities, negativities, any form of negativity, you sought to make this prayer. By the grace of God, it will help you to destroy those impurities and destroy the shams affecting your life. The second thing or the secret of salt you can get when you use it and have it is that with salt you can get a divine intervention through prayers. After praying with salt, you can sprinkle it around your house. It will also do the same thing, absorbing or destroying impurities. The most important thing salt does is that it absorbs impurities and destroy negativities. Once you pray with it and have it, you will see salt destroying it through the power of the Most High God. Salt is not the thing that will give you what you want, but that is part of its uses and its power. It absorbs impurity, but it is only God 
that uses salt to answer our prayer. That is why we are using salt, or you can use salt to pray. It works just like Elijah. Elijah used salt does not mean that salt is the thing that does this. It is God, but God used that salt to answer what Elijah prayed for. So use salt to pray, to get the same value with Elijah. So these are the secrets and benefits of salt you will get once you pray with salt. Now, to destroy your enemies, to absorb and destroy impurities, to destroy charms, to destroy any form of negativities, all you need is to bring salt like this. Salt like this. Now, I have told you what salt can do. So, how are you going to use it to generate or to get effective results or to get your good intentions? Bring salt like this. You can put it in a cup. You can put it in a bowl, plate, bucket, any place of your choice. The most important thing you need is to make the actual prayer that will help you to get a divine intervention. So what is that prayer? The prayers are two powerful psalms from the Bible. Yes, two powerful psalms that everyone knows. These two psalms work effectively anytime you pray with them. I am giving you total assurance. But the difference between you that never get results and anyone that get results, or you might be the one that will get the results, the only thing we need is faith. You can pray with salt. Once you have faith, it will start working. So the difference between someone that pray with salt that doesn't get a divine intervention and someone that pray with salt and get a divine intervention is faith. So if you have faith, I am giving you assurance that definitely you will get a divine intervention. So after getting your salt like this, now read two powerful psalms. What are the two powerful psalms? The first psalm you need to read is Psalm 51. Yes, Psalm 51 is a powerful psalm for mercy, for forgiveness, for abundance, for prosperities, for God to intervene in your life and to make things to start working for you. Yes, Psalm 51 is a powerful prayer for forgiveness. So hold that thought like this and read Psalm 51 over it. You can read from verse 1 down to 10 in case you want to save much of your time. You can read from verse 1 till the end of it. The choice is yours. Yes, the choice is yours. That is from verse 1 down to 19. It is a powerful prayer for forgiveness, for mercy, to ask God for his kindness, for his love, and for his divine intervention, and for forgiveness through everything you have done wrong. So read from verse 1 to 19, or from verse 1 to 10. So it depends the one you can do. So read this powerful psalm over that thought. And after reading it, the next psalm you need to read is a powerful psalm to destroy shams, to destroy enemies, to destroy barriers, bond, causes, any form of negativity working against you. Read it over this powerful thought. Then after, I will tell you what you will do with this thought after praying the second psalm. So the second psalm, which I trust most, which I relied most, which I love, which I like, which will give you divine intervention if you keep praying with it. If you keep praying with Psalm 35, I am giving you assurance that enemy will never withstand you. No evil spirit will see you and stand. No causes will walk over you. If you keep praying with Psalm 35, I am giving you assurance once again that your enemies will be scared of you. They can't do anything against you again because you will be like a burning fire. You will be like a divine fire. You will be like the Holy Spirit. Someone filled with Holy Spirit because Psalm 35 is a powerful prayer to destroy anything against human being 
on this earth. So read Psalm 35 from verse 1 down to 10. Yes, Psalm 35 is a powerful prayer for help, for God to give you a divine power to control demons, to destroy demons, to destroy evil spirits, enemies, anything working against you. So Psalm 35 is a powerful prayer you need to oppose your enemy, to oppose charms, to oppose negativities, and to destroy anything working against you. So read from verse 1 down to 10 also. If you have enough time, you can read from verse 1 down to 28. Perfect. But read from verse 1 down to 10 to avoid lack of concentration and to save much of your time to do other things in life. So after praying with Psalm 35 over this powerful source, now the next thing you need to do is to start telling God other things because Reading Psalm 35 and Psalm 51 is a powerful prayers, yet it is not all that you want to add. You can say, oh God, I need financial breakthrough. I need things to start working for me. I need your total divine intervention from now till maybe one week, a month, depending when you want to get a divine intervention. But I am giving you assurance that as you make prayer with these two powerful psalms and be consistent, every day of your life will be a day of favor, a day of money. You will see money coming into your hand. That your business that is not growing, that is not moving, will start moving. You will see people will be favoring you on daily basis because these powerful psalms will clear the air for you, will clear the road and make things to start working in life. So after praying with these powerful psalms and telling God all that you need, God, I need favor, I need money, I need financial breakthrough, I need miracles, I need my life to be a testimony, give me success, connection, promotion, whatever. Now, the next thing is for you to sprinkle these salts around your house or you can bury it at a particular place. You can bury it at a particular place and keep praying with Psalm 51 and Psalm 35 on daily basis. Anytime you wake up to pray, pray with two of them. They will help you to destroy any negativity working against you, to destroy sham working against you, to destroy your enemies, and things will keep working for you. So try it with faith. Please have faith like Elijah, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob you will get a divine intervention. So this is what I want to disclose in this video. And I strongly believe that it must be of great value to you. If you have questions and comments, do not hesitate to drop it in the comment section. In fact, I want you to comment on this video. Let me know exactly what you think. I hope you will get value and I pray that you will get value through this. I wish you the best. And I wish you every good thing life will offer. Bye.